Welcome to Family Gamer TV. Now we've got um, Skylander Superchargers here, but don't be confused. This is Crusher, the giant, but we're going to put him in Shark Tank. So we're taking this Light Core Skylander. I really miss the Light Core light up look of them. We're going to put him in Shark Tank and we're going to be racing in Chompy Garden. So I want to see not only how he looks in the car, but also how he performs. So we should get a nice close up zoom in on him as we. Whoa, look at him. He's so cool. His little spine's lighting up. Really matching that Shark Tank. Now, can I hit my turbo? You've got to keep it in the green. Keep it in the green. Yes, got my boom start. So as we race around, there's a real sense of presence and size to Crusher. Of course, this is a giant Skylander, but he's not um, looking sh hugely out of place in Shark Tank. There's a sort of a, a mechanical feel, which I think sort of fits his granite robust look. Um, and you can see if we go for a front camera, the tracks on Shark Tank as <laughs> I try and steer looking really cool and there is a sense that he's glowing up so obviously they're honoring that light core light up ability now we haven't had any light core characters announced for skylanders superchargers as far as i'm aware none of the current vehicles light up or none of the current characters light up i've not, certainly not seen them and light core seems to be something which has been consigned to the past but of course you can use all your old light core characters and you can use your giants as we are here <laughs> so i just fell off the track come on crusher let's keep it on the track um, it feels like he's a little bit slower. He's obviously a big character to, to um, hunt around the track to put in the tank. Although maybe that speed is more, <laughs> dear, more, didn't have the pace there to make that jump. It's more derivative of Shark Tank itself. If we can try it, there you go. I got a nice boost around that corner. You can hold the button down like you can in Mario Kart and get yourself a boost. Whether you can sort of zigzag like you could previously. Here we are. This is a really interesting power. Because I'm right at the back. It's giving me that rocket um, zoom up to the front attack much like Mario Kart um, and again you can see from the front is he sort of hunches over to to sort of gets his hands to the wheel to do some steering his hands are just much too big for the car <laughs> but he looks great I think this is a really nice feature of Skylander Superchargers that again you can go back if we can avoid this water or right through it you can go back and use all your old Skylanders in the game and it sort of breathes new life into them so it really honours that investment that families have made and i'd love to know which skylanders are you looking forward to seeing in the game i particularly like the sort of the, the trilogy the trio that we get now with three generations of skylanders so for example the youngest little terabyte which we're going to get into the game later the, the mini terrafin then you've got terrafin the normal one in the series one series two and then of course you've got shark shooter terrafin the sort of older brother that so that three generations have those together each taking turns in the the, um, the shark tank, Terrafin's vehicle for this game, um, and you have this sort of family mashup sort of feel, and I think my kids are going to enjoy doing that, going back to their collection, seeing who they want to pair up, and they'll be doing the minis, the giants, the swap force swappers. We've got Free Ranger. We're going to be bringing into the game a bit later in another video, just to see what they look like, and I think this is how we're going to play with it in the home. So if we get our eyes back on the racing, we've we've been through the first. Um, lap of chompy garden of course we're attacking a chompy villain the chompy mage i guess and i think that must be one of the see him in the background that is one of the um villains that come in the action racing packs that you can unlock which means then if you defeat him as we just look at these shields going around him from the front oh dear <laughs> yeah it helps if you look where you're going to steer but i just love looking at what crusher looks like um but if you get those racing action packs there'll be different villains that you can then defeat and once you've defeated them you can race as them because um, they then are stored in the trophy a little bit like the traps but you can also race as their vehicle now i want to know what um the chompy master the chompy mage's vehicle is going to be in the game look at that he was on red already i just took him out if you see any of your opponents come up and the target is red that means one hit and they're going to be down if it's green they're going to need lots of hits and then in between the two see those two those two are battling between them he's gonna um almost be gone i can just, if i come up behind i can finish them off and sort of get get the points and get the kill there you go. Now I collect these blues to refill my shooting. If I can do a nice little slide around the corner, that again, you see the tyres go red and that gives you that boost so I can avoid that water completely and I'm up into second. Can I get some hits in here? He's got his shield on. I need to wait until his shield goes unless I can just whiz past him with greater momentum. He hit the turbo pads too. Ah, we've both been hit with a, a um, hourglass which slows us down. But I hit the the launch pad the jump pad the warp pad that got me ahead so three of three now where's this finish line are we coming up to it race complete yes 
So Crusher, I think, is my first win um, in Shark Tank on Skylanders Superchargers Online Racing. We'll be back with more on Online Skylanders on Disney Infinity on Lego Dimensions soon.